What's going on, boys and ghouls? I got myself a special um, can of water, right? Liquid Death. The original um, water can. I could only find this one. I really wanted the sparkling seltzer because that's kind of what I'm more, more into. But, the, but they only had this at the uh, co-op. Here's the front side, the other side, the caption, which I'll read in a sec, bottom and top, right? And the, and the in the caption it says, this frosty can of pristine Austrian mountain water won't just refresh your body, it will murder your thirst. Well, how about that? Our proprietary thirst murdering process begins with liquid death forming a rope of veins that will wrap around your thirst head and strangle it. Once liquid death reaches your uh, thirst brain, all of your thirst memories will be replaced with repeating loops of its own head imploding, which is exactly what happens next by its causing your thirst head to implode and its brain to squirt out of its ears. How crazy is that now? And the font is hard to read, so if, if you hear me like stutter, it's not a stutter. It's just the font, it's just so fucking hard to read. Once your thirst has been murdered, the soul of your thirst will begin to escape and float towards the ceiling. At this point, drink a second sip of liquid death to rip its soul back down and force it to begin gluing its own body parts together so that it can crawl back inside you and eventually grow into a fully formed thirst once again. And it also uh, has death to plastic with a hashtag. Because these guys don't, don't like plastic. They prefer metal cans that you can recycle and you can make money off of. Anyway, let's open that, this bit, shall we? Liquid is clear, let's give it a try. Wow, that is like the most cleanest tap water you can imagine. Imagine drinking like filtered tap water at like the richest man's house you can imagine. This is like water that like, what's his face would drink? Jeff Bezos would drink. Like this is the cleanest and most purest water you can imagine. Liquid death. And if you're more into seltzer, I... I do warn you, it is extremely flat. But on the bright side, it's very, very clean and just flat, really. It's, it tastes like filtered water, literally. Made in Austria, huh? Mountain water from Austria. Well, I'll tell you, this is the cleanest water you can imagine right now. This is like hyper filtered. And the can itself was like about two bucks. So that could also be kind of a downer, but as an upper, at least even if you don't like drinking the water, you could give it to a friend or just get rid of all the water and recycle the can if you're into that, but. Who would want to waste two dollars worth of decent tasting water? I mean, come on. Wow. That is like super clean. And from what I can tell, it doesn't say exactly like what's in the water. All I can tell is that it's just water from the Austrian Alps, which I'll, I mean, I'll take it, but it doesn't say what minerals are in it, which if you ask me, there's not really any minerals in the water in the first place. You don't really taste any like other flavors, if you know what I mean. On a five star rating scale, I give it four out of five. If it was the seltzer water, I might have gave it a five stars out easy. Considering that it ain't seltzer, 
I'm giving it four. However, the purity of the water is just phenomenal. Like, if you don't, if you're sick and tired of drinking seltzer water all the time, this is definitely a highly recommend reprieve against drinking all the seltzer water. Because that's normally what I drink, right? Now oh, this is pretty damn good. Is, has my thirst been murdered? Not exactly. I've been driving around in 100 plus degree weather. And my car doesn't have AC, so I'm like soaked in my own sweat. Which sucks, but... At least I managed to get some liquid death water in order to uh, survive. And live on to the next day, which is good. And this for sure will be a great ashtray. This liquid death water. It's very deep. And when once the water is all consumed, this will definitely be used as an ashtray. Yep. That's what I do with cans. I use I treat them like ashtrays. It's one of my specialties. And it's definitely cool in terms of the actual can. Very just direct ed and kind of edgy. Has that kind of like punk rock kind of vibe to it. But uh, I mean, it's not my absolute favorite drink. But here's the thing. But it's definitely up there in terms of its aesthetic value. That's another thing I've noticed about uh, the liquid death drink. <sighs> anyway, you just watched my review of liquid death mountain water. It's very clean and flat. It tastes ultra, ultra purified, right? It literally tastes like water you would get at like a rich man's house if he had a filter in his refrigerator. It is like the most cleanest tasting water money can buy. And it's definitely refreshing against drinking a lot of like mineral water or seltzer. Not that there's anything wrong with that, but sometimes that extra like carbonation irritates the throat. That's just me though. Anyway, you just watched my review of Liquid Death. I'm going to go pitch it and stay tuned for more videos. Rock and roll as always.